There's a tree growing outside the tenement window. But not just any tree. It's a tree that grows through concrete in the poorest areas of the city. A tree that's resilient and full of life. A tree that manages to be beautiful in spite of the poverty and squalor that surround it. Kind of like the protagonist in this week's pick. Francie Nolan has a hard life. It's the turn of the century in Brooklyn, New York, and Francie lives with her mother, brother, and alcoholic father in a neighborhood rife with crime and dirt and hungry children. But Francie is her father's daughter, romantic and with an eye for beauty, and Brooklyn seems wonderful to her. There's the library and the penny candy store and the marvelous organ grinder whom she follows from street to street. Life is cold and hard for Francie, but it's also golden. A tree grows in Brooklyn follows Francie from her wide-eyed childhood into the stark realities of her adolescence and then into her late teens as she earns her way in the world. This is a coming-of-age story to be sure, and a long one. It also may be my very favorite book ever, although that's a tough call. A Tree Grows in Brooklyn certainly has its share of ugliness. The author doesn't spare many details about the harsh realities of Francie's growing up years, but it's also exquisitely beautiful with a cast of characters so real that you'll feel like you know them. And in my opinion, Everyone should know them. A Tree Grows in Brooklyn is a gem and a book you absolutely shouldn't miss.